this with myself. I say, chances are you don't need an attorney right now. <laughs> but well, what if you suddenly do need one? You've been in an accident on the job or in your car, one of your cars. That's when you need to know you can count on someone. Someone is something to play properly, fairly. How do you find that someone? It's as easy as picking up the fucking piss-soaked sponge you keep in a Tupperware dish next to the driver's side seat and walking out of the car with it up to the fucking and the person who's infracting your spirit and you squeeze it on their fucking head. You squeeze a piss sponge on your enemy's head, dude. And you recover your dignity. People don't respect you in public. That's not my fault. <laughs> I tried to be romantic with someone I didn't trust. I said, like this. I come up into your, into your experience, into your field of memories. I walk up with a fucking shrimp platter. I resemble someone from the TV show of the 1980s. I'm all up in your, on your inner home. <laughs> well, I guess we've been together for a million years. And I guess we're... Ah! 
and your life has changed because I've arrived. The thing you inhabit, all you have, this, this, this little bitch right here, that's all you got. You walk around in it. You haunt it. You haunt your own fucking cage. How'd that happen? Darkness everywhere. I come in with a fucking sweet little match. I say, what is this place? Nobody's been in here for a long time. Give up control. Ooh. Romantic. Romantic man enters your field of vision. Shrimp platter. Piss filled sponge. Here, all alive with light. And I derive a new meaning from simplicity. There's a border, there's a mountain range between us. There's pigs, beautiful pigs, the clouds. All I want in the world, dude, is to cross the peak and come up in. Come up on. Come up in your mind. Can I come up and all over your mind and visit? Can I come visit you? And I'll tell you a story about history. I have it all right here. The Commonwealth has a very rich and complex history that's fucking smeared with blood. There's blood on the ground. We don't think of it that way and that's good because if we did it would fucking, oh. Oh, God, you'd be on the toilet m much more than you are already. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. But it's me, dudes, it's me. It's me, let me in! Let me in! <laughs> Keep me! Keep me! I'm good! I'm horrible, but I'm good that way. I'm terrible, but I'm really useful in my terrible quality. Trust me, dude, I live in the boundary. When you're scared, when you're scared and you're at the edge, and you're not sure, I'll tap the edge with you. Tap the boundary, dude. Cross the line, motherfucker. Let's make a new anthem, dudes. B baby, boy, and girl. Let's make a new anthem together. Do you want to join me in a song? Yeah. Good. I'm happy to hear it. My, my father died a long time ago, but he worked down the street from me. I haven't been there in a long time. He worked in a printing, a printing plant, um, and he knew a guy named uh, Clem. And Clem got fucking, uh, what's the disease when we don't eat any fruit? Scurvy. Because he thought a diet of cigarettes and Diet Pepsi would do the trick. First recorded case of scurvy in like 50 years, bitches. That's where I come from. Connected scurvy. Here's, my, here's a new anthem, dude. Commonwealth, 2050. Goes like this. Sometimes it feels kind of treasonous <laughs> To be so cool To be so cool Will you join me? Yeah. Sometimes it feels kind of treasonous To be so cool To be so cool Sometimes it feels kind of treasonous I thought this was a festival. <laughs> Sometimes it feels kind of treasonous to be so cool. To be so cool. I get the uh-oh. Sometimes it feels kind of treasonous to be so cool. To be so cool. Yeah! Sometimes it feels kind of treasonous to be so cool. To be so cool. Uh-oh.
Uh-huh. Do you wanna take a tiny bit of pee 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 pee? Take a poo Dudes, keep me in, keep me in your heart. Let me check my phone. Keep me in your spirit world. I'll be good to you, even if you fucking don't know it. Dude, why does this, why does God have a problem with me? <laughs> My tape deck hit the ground. Aw, oh, shit. This lady helped. Like how I narrate, I'm narrator of my old real life in real time. Narrator, thank you, miss. Positivity reigns supreme in my butt body. In my brown hair. One more story before I go. Once when I thought I was gonna be an, I work, in a, work for Hollywood, I worked for an advertising agent in Copley Square, and I didn't belong there, and that's okay. But I went out to this Italian fucking bistro in the North End with a bunch of executives. There was pizza and pasta and shrimp. It was the middle of the day, and I distinctly understood that the people I was with felt good about the fact that they could drink in a dark dining room in the afternoon. I didn't say a word, and no one said any word to me. As we were leaving, though, this woman came up behind me and she said, Ben, you, I had a ponytail. She said, Ben, you have beautiful hair. And I said, oh, yeah. <laughs> and I took out my hair and in the, in the, it was May, the sun was gorgeous. Back then I had brown streaks of silver of gold. Uh, like a tuna or a goldfish, a catfish probably, catfish. Are you like me? Did you discover mortality whilst on LSD in a graveyard? I did. There was a pond in the graveyard and there were these fucking sick catfish, greedy little catfish, you could spit on them and they'd come up and take a bite. And I'd spit on those motherfuckers and I'd sneer at them as they came up and took a bite. And I'd sit on a tombstone, and I'd finger the letter on the tombstone. Three-dimensional letters. You want to change your world? Consider the alphabet three-dimensionally. Okay, every letter in the word is independently minded. Okay? And I would be like, oh, fucking bar barrette, or whatever the word was. Finger the letter T. Get, the, get your hand across the donate, your fingers like a donation against the truth of stone, right? You know, you know. You had your fucking, you had your head on a gravesite, rollerblading in the graveyard, you smoked way too much, wand, it's a different kind of weed, wand. You smoked a lot of wand. Your friends didn't want to be on rollerblades, but you were there, you had another pair, you're like, you gotta do this if you care about me. You're rollerblading through the graveyard. Too much drug, it's daytime, you shouldn't be this high during the day. No jobs, except you have one, but you don't care about it. And there's, dead, there's a dead sense in the air. And what the fuck? The goddamn, Matt, what the hell is going on with the spirit world, the spirit world as I call it. The spirit world. If you don't remember anything from this festival, remember the word spirit. Spirit world, dude. The spirit world is clogged. It's fucking clogged out. Too many, I mean, like, we're talking, we're talking, it's a, pro, it's a problem. I don't want to get into it anymore. I'm done with that, done with that aspect of this, this performance. <laughs> Anyway, there's blood everywhere across my body, and if somehow you find a way to get your hand into my blood, and you can fucking touch my blood, probably means I gotta trust you. <laughs> you traversed a very tr problematic territory, and you got your hands in my blood, okay? You're, you're what, guess what? You're the warrior now. You're the warrior, you're the shaman, you're the doctor. You come to me now. Well, if you get in there, then I, I know I can trust you, so guess what? That's the test. That's the test! Please, 
peace, blood, and patriot, patriotic Massachusetts. You are tre you are treasonous, motherfucker. Keep standing up against the wall. Slap the wall. All right. Uh, uh, Thank you!